Whether you believe it or not, the world around you is filled with strange phenomena that science has yet to explain. And in those unfortunate moments when people come face to face with them, they are helplessly thrown into the dark depths of fear. But there are those who choose to fight against the darkness every day, shining a ray of hope into that chaos. These warriors opposing the shadows are called psychics. You're in luck! I, Regan Arataka, shall accept this job! Oh my god, really? Thank you so much! I had no idea who else I could turn to. No one would take me seriously. There, there, it's okay. Now, the fee for my services will depend on which course of exorcism you pick. Which course? Option A, the trial course, gets you 20%. Option B, the serious course, gets you 50%. And option C, the all-out course, gets you a 99% spirit reduction. 100% guaranteed, certain restrictions apply. Reduction? How should I put this? Spirits are kind of like carbon dioxide. So you're saying they're poisonous? It's monoxide. I mean, they occupy a sort of gaseous space. Makes it a bit difficult to completely get rid of one. That said, have no fear. If it comes back, I'll get rid of it for 20% off! Wow, you're so amazing! Hold on a second! Huh? And who might you be? Oh, this is Taro. He's my boyfriend. Ah, what a calm fellow. What's that supposed to mean? Ugh, stick to the subject. Listen up, you. This is all super shady. Uh... Hanako, you should really reconsider this. Super shady, huh? I guess I can't blame you for feeling that way. I mean, all that stuff about nightmares and ghosts. What a stupid story. I wasn't talking about her, you sneak oil salesman. It's you I can't trust. Just leave everything to me. If I exorcise the spirit, I'm sure Hanako's face will return to normal, too. There's nothing wrong with her face, you moron! I see. So you've been having these dreams since you walked through that abandoned building last week. Yes, that's right. They're so scary and creepy. Here we are, Reagan. It's that building over there. <clears throat> what an unbelievable aura! This will be my first big one in a long time! It's right over here. <gasps> Hold up. Did you just point at the wrong building? Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, so it's that one! Funny story! An immense aura was coming from that other building, too. If these things happen, nature of the biz, it gets confusing with all these evil spirits in the world, you know? Ah, uh, yes, that makes sense. Come on, there's no way ghosts are hanging around everywhere. Oh, no! A man-shaped evil spirit almost walked through you! Huh? Whew, what a close call. You can't be too careful these days. <laughs> the butt-chin goblin. Now, what are you, eight years old? Shut your mouth, Taro. You're being rude. He's the one who's being rude here. Making fun of people's looks. Now, now, Hanako. There are always people like him. Silly skeptics. Anyway, shall we go? They say this place is haunted by the angry spirit of a man who saw a cockroach. He freaked out and jumped so high his head went through the ceiling. Such a horrific way to go. Get a grip. You believe that horse crap? Oh, I see. Everything's becoming so clear. He's so serious all of a sudden. Could there really be? Oh, I'm getting creepy vibes. Even someone like me might not be able to handle it. It's too dangerous! <laughs> Cockroaches are terrifying! Huh? Come on! There's no way this guy is a psychic! He's a complete and total fake! <sighs> How would you like me to haunt your dreams, too? A ghost! Maybe I'll use my curse and crash both your heads through the ceiling. Ah! That's the guy who keeps head butting me in my dreams! Ah! Ah, he actually appeared. I've got this! Salt Splash! This is one of Reagan's special attacks where he violently throws table salt everywhere. This is just regular old salt, you buffoon. If it's not purified, it's not gonna work. Impossible. I heard that spirits were totally weak against any kind of salt. Well, if salt won't melt this guy down, I'll just call my ultimate weapon. Uh, 
Hey, Mob, sorry, do you think you could swing by? I'm being serious here. Evil Spirit's right in front of me. The client and the evil spirit are both waiting, so you'll need to hurry, okay? Cool, thanks. Huh? Hey, Mob! We were waiting for you. Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> So after the salt, you're sending in a middle schooler? Get your... He is Shigeo Kageyama, also known as Mob, an actual psychic mentoring under the questionable expertise of Regen Arataka, who also happens to be the protagonist of this story. Master... I asked you not to summon me on such short notice. If everyone is not special, maybe you can be what you want to be. So let's learn the God that I need to call you. Dollar! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Man, you're a lifesaver. Never thought that evil spirit would actually show up. Here, your pay for the day. Oh, thank you. That one today was just a lower level spirit, so I really shouldn't be paying you more than half. But hey, I'm a nice guy. Think of your full pay as a bonus. Right. Hmm? What's wrong? Are you not okay with that? Oh, no. Just don't know why you called me to handle such a weak spirit. I mean, ones like that. Uh, you just don't get it. When you reach my level, you get so crazy strong you end up melting everyone around you during a simple exorcism. That's why I ask you to take care of the weaker ones. Really? If you say so. I'm also not quite sure what you mean by melt either. Well, of course you don't, idiot. That's because you lack training. You need to learn all you can from me, your master. Your powers are meant to be used. Not doing so would be a waste. Working for me gives you the opportunity to help other people and continue training at the same time. Two birds, one stone. But if you misuse a power such as yours, it can only lead to your own self-destruction. That's why I'm teaching you how to control your powers. You don't want them to go berserk, do you? Remember your promise. You will not use your psychic powers against other people. You go again, always bending spoons. You really need to stop doing that. It's a bad habit. Oh, come now, my dear. Shigeo's going through puberty. A young man should be able to bend a spoon from time to time, right? <sighs> Sorry. And there you go, spoiling the boy again. You need to learn a thing or two from Ritsu Shige. He got another perfect score on his quiz today. Come on, Mom. Anyone can do that. Listen, if you ever need someone to talk to, let me know. I'll always be there for my big brother. Thanks. I appreciate it. Will do. And now you're spoiling him as well, Ritsu. The next one you bend gets replaced using your allowance, you hear? Huh? Sorry, dude. Tough break. You're on your own when it comes to what Mom tells you. <laughs> now you're in a real pickle, aren't you, Shigeo? Good morning, Tsubomi. Good morning. 
beautiful day, isn't it? Oh, guess what I saw on TV yesterday. Sir Balmy's as cute as ever today. Okay, class. So what would be the answer for this one? Let's go with Kageyama. Huh? Yes, sir. Uh, um, I have no idea. If you can't solve this, that would mean the only thing you know how to do is addition. You were asleep, weren't you? Forget it. Sit down, please. Heads up! This way! Pass! 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 No! Stop him! Come on! Pass him! Hello? Bob, how goes it? Sorry to call you two days in a row, but could you come down to the station right now? Sure. What for? Well, we've got another job, and it's a big one. Right. Okay, see you soon. Today's job is from a local neighborhood council. It's over at Honedo Tunnel, along the old highway. It's a famous haunted place. The tunnel's always had some shady stories. And though it's been closed for years, the bad rumors just won't go away. Also, a number of college students and bloggers have gone there to snoop around a little and went missing, likely contributing to those rumors. And this is the kicker. So it's the site of a huge group accident? Yeah, the incident occurred about 30 years ago. From what it says here, more than 20 people died at once. The bitter hatred of all those people must be swirling around that tunnel. Stay on your toes, Mob. Never know what might happen. Oh, right. This is it. Well, let's take a look around. I, Regan Arataka, new star of the paranormal world, will clean this place up. We're gonna exorcise every last one of them. <laughs> What's the big idea? What are you doing, student? You're coming too! It'll be bad if the sun goes down. Mom, are you listening? I'm gonna go melt down a big one, so follow me! Okay? Sure, if you want. You seem to have it under control, so I didn't think that you'd need my help. Idiot! Who do you think's gonna ex- <clears throat> I mean, this is nothing, really. But stick with me so you can learn something. Hmm? You're amazing, Master. Huh? I mean, this tunnel actually seems pretty dangerous. Uh I can sense the presence of a very powerful spirit further down. Usually haunted spots like these end up being fake, but this time, it's definitely the real deal. If a normal person happened to anger the spirit in here... What would happen? They'd never make it out in one piece. <laughs> of course they wouldn't. That's why you and I are going to exorcise it. All right, here we go. Let me take the lead. I'll be counting on you to support me however you can from behind. Right. It's kind of chilly down here. Yes, it is. Great, we forgot to bring flashlights with us. Master, don't you feel something? Hmm? Well, it is pretty humid in here. No, I'm talking about auras. Oh, right, that. My nose is a little stuffy today, so... Does that have anything to do with sensing auras? When you get to my level, it does. Do you feel anything down here at all? Feeling anything would be an understatement. There are 12. 18. No, wait. I'd say even more than that. Right nearby us. Uh, <laughs> it looks like we're being surrounded. They're going to attack us now. All right. I'll leave the small fry to you. Go, mob! Man, that's a lot of noise. They're really strong, aren't they? Hmm, if we were a couple of normal people, we might have been in real danger. Oh, well, I'm pretty sure that took care of all of them. Another piece of cake. <laughs> 
There's someone right in front of me! Who are you? An evil spirit! Oh, it's just a wrestler scurrying around in the dark. Don't scare me like that. I thought you were an evil spirit. Now go practice somewhere else. Uh, Master? I'm sure you sense it, but the boss of the evil spirits is over there, so watch out, okay? Oh. <laughs> so you're the boss here, huh? You may have tried to disguise yourself as a wrestler, but you can't fool me, you trickster! <gasps> you fool! In this tunnel! When my biker gang and I were driving through it, the guy in front happened to slip on a banana peel! We all die! And I'm their leader! Listen up! This tunnel is my turf now! Do you understand? I'll crush every last intruder! Here we go! I curse you! Cigarette food! Hold What? My ignition attack! It isn't working! <laughs> A force field? No way! How could this power be coming from someone like him? Oh crap! I thought this guy was just an average wimp! Too late for regrets now, spirit! The moment you tried to take on the genius psychic Regan Arataka was the moment your fate was sealed. You're gonna be exorcised! Finishing sometimes! This is one of Regan's special attacks where he punches the enemy with his fist covered in table salt! <laughs> Hold on a second, that didn't hurt at all. Oh dear. So you are a fake! <laughs> Go back to the ozone layer. We were just being forced to do this! Hmm? Hey, what are you doing, Mob? Hurry up and melt them already. Hold on a minute, Master. Let's hear him out first. <laughs> Sure, I may act tough, but neither me nor my gang are anything compared to the evil spirit down the tunnel. We've been getting orders from him all these years, and that's why we've been scaring people that come down here. <laughs> Do you think you can fool the likes of Reagan with such lies, you little speck? I'm not lying to you! It's just, if I were to disappear while being falsely accused, my brothers, the Death Spectres, and I just couldn't take it. Our memories would never rest in peace. That's all I wanted to say! Now you can make me disappear or melt or whatever! So your big plan is to try to make us pity you? Don't let him fool you, Mob. Those are nothing but the typical lies of a con artist. Melt him. Before that, I'm gonna go have a look. Huh? It's a little weird that the aura I felt before coming in here hasn't disappeared yet. Something's still not right. Hmm? Uh, I thought so too. Stop him! Huh? No matter how strong that kid may be, he doesn't stand a chance against it! That thing is an evil spirit that's lived on this mountain for hundreds of years! Everyone that's died here was killed by him, you understand? So, so you guys were also killed by- No, like I said, we just happened to slip on a banana peel. Yeah, that evil spirit wasn't very powerful. 
No way! Who, who are you? Huh? Oh, I'm nobody. You idiot! You're mob, and you are the student of... The new star of the paranormal world, Regan Ortega! Oh, right, sorry. <laughs> I thank you, mob. Now the Death Spectres gang can leave this tunnel and pass on peacefully. Oh, could this be yours? Huh? All right, here we go, boss man. Yeah. I want to thank you. Thanks, dude. Now we can depart to the afterlife. Mob. Our work here is done. Let's go. Right. By the way, Master. Huh? Why didn't you do anything back there? Oh, uh, well, you know, uh... <laughs> didn't I tell you from the beginning that I'd leave the small fries to you? Oh, right. <laughs> What do you want to do? Let's get something to eat. I'm not gonna last until I get home. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. Sorry to keep you waiting, shall we? Sure. So, does ramen work for you? Uh-huh. All right, well, if you're gonna add on chashu pork, limit it to two. Okay. Here you go! A group of telepaths suddenly appear and disturb Mob's daily life. Having doubts about his peaceful youth, Mob heads into a world of women. Where's the goal? Which way's tomorrow? Next time on Mob Psycho 100, Episode 2. Doubts about youth, the telepathy club appears. Watching it in real time, wise decision. If everyone is lost, maybe you can be what you want to be. You look, be, and I